Today we find ourselves out in the woods. I'm on my e-bike, we're joined by Ollie once again, who's on his mini little enduro-y sort of slope style free ride bike, which is really cool. And we are gonna spice things up because we've got the kicker ramps with us. I've ridden these woods for absolutely years since I was Ollie's age. And the lines don't get boring, it's super exciting, but it's also fun to spice things up and look at things from a new perspective by adding the ramps in. And that is exactly what we're doing in today's video. The first setup which I'm going to be riding is with a red ramp and I'll just talk to you for it quickly. This is one of my favourite little lines. You can normally just bonk off of the tree stump in and it goes to like a step down and then a quarter pipe which is random to have here. But with the ramp I'm utilising this dead log by actually gapping over into it. It's a nice steep, that, look at that landing. That's perfect down there isn't it? Yeah. Like that is so good. So we're utilising the log, got it as a bit of a gap feature, got it as a bit of a mani pad, hopefully it's going to be some contact. But first of all, let's just hit it into the bank. Right, let's hit this then. It's kind of a curved run up, but I think it'll work good. Oh yes! Step down, scrub a bit of speed off before airing the quarter pipe on the e-bike. <laughs> and there's Ollie's little gap, which we're going to come right in a minute. That was so good. What a jump. Does that look all right? Yeah, it looks cool. Yeah, it's fun boosting up and over that. I think we should get like a little slow motion he stees over it. That'd be really, really exciting. That was sick. That is such a nice setup perfect hit nice landing it's rare that you come across a setup this good for the hoppers what i'm going to do though is the first thing i thought when i saw this was the fact that you can actually like manual or bonk on it so let's just try get a little bit of contact oh, that's sketchy. That is well sketchy i like my weight went to the wrong side of the bike but that's cool, we're gonna get that in slow motion and focus on the contact. Every time I see you, yeah. Every time I see you, girl, it takes me to another world where only sunshine fills the sky. Sunshine, sunshine. Every time I take your hand, I feel like I'm a rising man because you're lonely. Right, Ollie, what have you got here then? Yeah, I've got the little one what Tom Slimely lended to me yeah. to try today. And I think if he's wanted to, we'll do a train. And I've got quite a big gap into a massive slope. Yeah, so massive. over a bike lamp. But me and Tom are going to train it. Nice, let's see it so, then. Yeah. Everyone's seen your ride skate park, it's now time to show the world kicker ramping. Oh, you went massive. <laughs> Massive. Yeah. Yes, dude, that was sick. Right, dropping in then. About to go over the edge. You! Yeah. Oh, yeah. Good jump, followed by a really steep hill on the way down. You know all about that one. That's I quite scary, yeah, isn't it? That's a scary one to do. Yeah, that was sick. Do you want to get, whilst we're here, we've got this set up, do you want to do one on your own for a slow motion? Sure. Yeah. Go on in, that's it. Nice I think I'm done with that. Yeah? You, you did it though, that's a scary one. Not my toe, I'll toe did pump the, um, the pedal. Uh oh. <laughs> We've come to the top of the ski jump, I've set the hopper up here. It's a scary landing on this one because, take a look at this. So steep at the top and then it goes flatter. But there's a jump there normally down, which is cool. But for some reason with this set up there, it just seems that way so much more scary. So I'm gonna just hit it and hopefully we can pull that gap back a bit. Right, I'm going to start from higher up and try to link it together as a full line, or half a trail, should I say. Nice, right, through the trees. Okay, we're about to shred into the kicker. 
scary. Woo! Scary. Woo. You go so quick from there. Manny line. Perfect. And Suey, you. That was quite good. I got that pretty smooth there. And then I managed to link a full line, which you wouldn't have seen because you was here. But did it look right from your yeah, look good. perspective? Yeah. Look, nice. It's not my cup of tea, I have to say, but... It's pretty scary. For you, it looks fun. Yeah, it's like jumping off the edge of the world there. Yeah. I might just come back a little bit with it and try to see if we can go a bit bigger. Okay. I don't know how much. I don't think you want to go massive, do you? But that will do. What was that, that, wasn't it? Yeah. It's terrifying. That's good. Right, we're back on with a bigger send this time. So good that burn actually. Shred into that. You! You! So quick there. So quick there. Literally overcleared the whole landing. Oh, I missed the Manny challenge. Let's get a crank flip. Oh, half. <laughs> Perfection does not exist, people. That was another good one. I messed up the end of the run a bit, but Ollie, he's keen that he's already yeah. pulling it back for me. How big are you going to make it, Ollie? Whoa, whoa, whoa. Oh my God. That's quite big now, isn't it? Yeah. Did I clear it out though, didn't I? Yeah. Like, easy. Perfect. Yeah. Cool, okay, I'm in. I think I made it a little bit too big. Nah, you need to push him. Do you remember you pushed him at the skate park? So oh, you've yeah. got to do it again in the woods. <laughs> yeah. And this is pretty big now. Yes, there's the crank flip. That was so... I mean, the gap was all right, actually. But, but you went so deep on this. Oh my God, I didn't... I just kind of was like stoked that I'd done that. That I didn't break for the other one. Oh my God, it's a long way down on that. And I was just in the air like, oh no. Yeah. Poof. Unfortunately, I'm going to be a party pooper because unless we go to the other side of the tree, which is just ridiculous, then I don't think you can actually make it sit flat no, but the root, look. yeah and then yeah. if it was back it'd have to be back here which is flat but that's just that is massive isn't it yeah oh that's a ridiculous gap so but, i think hey but you've got one more haven't you we've got and one more ollie wants to try the red one don't you yeah so should we do that new location we've come back to the first zone that we was at because ollie has decided he wants to hit the red kicker after setting me really big mean gaps he stepped up to the plate and wants to try it for himself. So we've got it set up here into this like perfect landing. It's a pretty scary setup. It's a scary ramp. He's inbound now, so I'm gonna get out of the way. Oh. You've got that, yeah. Easy. Yeah! Yeah, Ollie, that's sick. Gee, that's sick. What a line. I think what Ollie wants to do now is he wants to pull the gap back. So yeah. I'm going to be, it's my turn to make the gap now. You were doing it a minute ago. Oh, the tables have turned. Oh, okay, more? Do you want more? Yeah. More? Just a tiny bit. Stop. Yeah? Okay. Oh, nice. That was cool. That looked well good. That was cool, wasn't it? I might do a little suey off it quickly. Nice. Right, train time on the new gap that he's sending. Oh yes, massive! <laughs> Woo. Nice. Ollie, that was so sick. How does that feel riding that? Is it good? So good. Yeah, just like boosting it absolutely perfectly, which is 
really sick. And once again, the hopper amp is showing how versatile and how it helps you to sort of overcome that fear and push your limits, which is, which is really good fun. And we've put it in some pretty fun locations today. I thought it'd be a bit easier than it has been. I thought we'd be able to set up a few more sort of features and shred a bit more, but it's been fun. It's been cool. It's always a pleasure to be out on the e-bike and it's always a pleasure to come ride my local, which I've been riding since I was probably younger than Ollie. So if you've enjoyed this one, please give us a thumbs up, leave your comments below, and we will see you guys in the next video.